Everything is starting during the lockdown, the second week during the lockdown for COVID-19. It really hit me when I heard the airports are completely closed, the, the countries that we were supposed to be doing concerts and conferences completely closed. And imagine we are in New York, so we are a hot spot. We are the epicenter for the whole world, you know, with this virus. So it really hit me this, uh, during two days, I was just wearing my pajamas and going back to bed. I was very sad. I was like, what am I supposed to do? I'm here in lockdown, now the airports are closed, the countries are closed, what am I supposed to do? You know, I love interaction. I love to pray for people. I love this, I love the touch. And it really hit me. Uh, so during two days, I was wearing pajamas and going back to bed. The third day, my awakening came. Uh, my resurrection day came when I read the scripture where it says, John, uh, I give you the perfect peace. It's not a peace like, it's not like the world, the, the, the peace that the, the world is, is talking about because it's not peace, it's just bad news. And it says in that part of, of the, the Bible verse says, take courage. So do not be discouraged, basically do not be sad, take courage. And that word, it was a highlight for me that word came alive in me and i allow you know to that word to come alive and uh, i make a choice i decide just to get up that day the third day i set up all my studio lights i put it on my living room and i said i'm gonna do my my own worship from my living room i'm gonna i just gonna worship god raw worship with no instruments with no musicians with no nothing my my laptop and my telephone and my tracks is what i'm gonna share with the world is what I was doing it for one month. I start reaching out people, you know, bringing my living room experience, worship experience in my living room to the world. And after that, I was doing it for a month, every single day. Then Good Friday came. That Good Friday, I have the whole panorama for this video from the beginning to the end. I saw every single slice, every single shot that you see in the video, I saw it in my mind. It was like a supernatural thing. I never experienced something like that. And I started uh, writing and everything, and I was going back to my husband. I said, I feel in this, I am seeing, you know, uh, the whole world worshiping God. I, I, I really feel that an awakening is happening in the whole world. So I start reaching people, you know, out. I start reaching out people around the world. Uh, so I wrote five continents with one purpose. And dawn in the living room, basically dawn means, mean, means like it's an awakening. You awake. When the dawn is co comes, you, you are awake. So literally what is happening, dawn in the living room in every single, in every part of the world, in every single living room around the world. So basically is when I, I share my experience. And I picked this song, uh, uh, Your Name, Cry of the Broken, because that song was really my anthem during this, this uh, lockdown. So this is done in the living room. Literally, we have people from all over the world. The first person that I reach out to is my MD from New Jersey, Giancarlo. Uh, I share the vision with him. And then uh, a small vision, you know, let's go do something very locally. That's it. The next day I called him and I said, listen, we're going to change the whole thing. This is uh, a global thing. So hold tight, I will hold you back. <laughs> I called and then I text uh, Luke Moons. He is a producer, amazing producer in Australia. I invite him just to be part of the, the song. Like, would you like, you know, to sing the second verse with me? And I love how God put all the pieces together because at the end of the day, he's co-producing uh, the song with us and not just that, he did the mix and mastering for the song. Then I reach out to uh, my beautiful family, friends in California, the Moore family. They did projects in the past, so they are part of this too. And then I was reaching out to uh, worship leaders, pastors and worship leaders from all over the world from North America, from uh, the UK, from Singapore, Indonesia, New Zealand, and South Africa, and North America. I, I don't want to miss anybody. So I'm sorry if I repeat it myself. And then, you know, God brought uh, Josh. He is the editor. He was the one who put all the pieces together, you know, in this video.
video and I am very grateful because everybody is sharing their gifts and their talents and to bring hope, hope for what we are facing right now with this pandemic. The message that we want to share with the world is the message of hope. Um, a lot of people are struggling with depression, with loneliness, they're mourning, uh, they lost their loved ones, uh, they lost their jobs. Um, it's very difficult for people to not you know, have that kind of interaction, you know, uh, social distancing and everything. It's a lot of questions, a lot of questions, and people, they're they looking for answers. And the only answer that we can bring for, for that people who watch the video is, is Jesus. Jesus is the only one who can give you hope, who can give you freedom, who can heal you, who can transform your life, who can bring comfort and peace during this time that you are mourning. He is the only one who can bring you that peace that the world cannot give you and can give you the joy because the joy of the Lord is your strength. So that is the message that we want to share with the world, the message of hope, the message of freedom, message of salvation, message of peace message of everything is gonna be all right because he knows the plans that he has for you plans for good and no evil to bring you hope in a future you're gonna be able to watch it on YouTube the premiere is May 14 7 p.m. and then you're gonna be able to download the song uh, in all digital outlets we're gonna release the song um, after the premiere and you're gonna be able to download the song for free with no cost every musician every uh, producer and every uh, vocal and background vocal they just share their talents and nobody is charging anything so we decide just to give the song for free uh, my husband and I, this, we were talking, I said, you know what, we need to give the song for free and just, you're going to be able to download the song, the mp3, in any single uh, digital outlet, Spotify, iTunes, Amazon, everywhere.